Yes. Uh, going to Broncos and Dove Valley, more bad news for defensive end Derek Wolf. Yeah. Uh, suffered a concussion uh, during training camp. Now, this is on top of already being suspended for the first four games of the regular season because he failed the NFL's performance enhancing drug policy for reasons we don't know. Uh, but anyway, um, just more bad news for, for Derek Wolf. He's, he's had a rough, he's really just had a rough go of it in his NFL career, and this just sort of adds to it. Yeah, I, I was out there this morning poking around, asking questions, and um, they haven't yet figured out just how severe the concussion is. I watched him get carted off the field yesterday. He had a towel over his he head. He did have everything. a towel over his head. In fact, at first I thought it might have been dehydration or, or, really? or heat stroke or something like that. But it wasn't concussion. Um, and uh, I, I think they're still, again, trying to figure it out. They're going through the protocol. They yeah. don't really know how severe it is at this you, point. But, but you, you, you go can, through the pro concussion protocol yeah. if you have a concussion. So you, can, a concussion. you can guess he's going to uh, be gone for at least a week. But again, we've got Seven weeks until the season starts. Mm -hmm. Six weeks until the season starts. And he's not going to be playing anyway. They, they, <laughs> what do you mean? Well, he's, he's suspended for the first. Oh, game. that's right. He's that's right. That's right. Yeah. I mean, he might. He's allowed to play in preseason games, of course. Right. Uh, which you know, missing even that is is going to be. I just yeah. can't imagine how rusty will be by the first week of October. In that discussion I was having with people with the Broncos, I said it, it's a real shame. It's always a shame when somebody suffers a concussion, but it's a real shame because he's been playing really well this mm -hmm. preseason. He's. This is not. These are not my words. These are the words of a Broncos exec. He's been playing pissed off. Like he's he got wants, something to prove. Yes. Especially well, after you know he's had some problems with with yeah. the injuries uh, over the last uh, couple Medical of years, ailment, and like, now and now nailed for uh, violating the substance abuse policy. He's playing pissed off. This won't help matters. No, no. We were talking Woody about the fact that Derek Wolf has a concussion. Just more bad news for a guy that's. Had, again, kind of an up-and-down NFL career. Uh, seems like he's kind of getting back to his place and being able to contribute to the Broncos, and then something like this no, happens. Yeah, double whammy here. Yeah, double whammy. Well, I think it's a, that there's a couple of things going on. When they traded down to get him, mm -hmm. and you know who they got with the pick after they traded down? Brock Osweiler. <laughs> so... <laughs> Uh, they're kind of linked as, as forever as far as I'm concerned. They're bonded. And Derek Wolf hasn't lived up to the expectations. He came in here, you know, he's a tough guy from Cincinnati. And he had injury issues, he had that seizure on the bus, and he is uh, now had a substance, a, a, a performance PED, drug, whatever, whatever yeah. it's called. Uh, and, and I wish he would have come out. I wish these guys, just not out of curiosity, I wish they'd tell us what it was. But we had a player say, well, I took a birth control kind of thing. Really? Oh, yeah, I remember, remember that. that? Gosh, <laughs> yeah, I remember that. Uh, oh, really? Yeah, okay. It was a women's birth control kind of pill. No, I don't believe that. So 